Hey guys, what's up? This is Gum, and welcome to Layers of Fear on the PC. This is a remake collection of Layers of Fear 1, 2, their DLCs, and also some new story that they are releasing all on Unreal Engine 5. I got an early review code for this, so I'm very interested to check this out, especially because I never actually played the original Layers of Fear or Layers of Fear 2. I was meaning to get around to it, so, uh, you know, this kind of works out. But uh, all right, let's go ahead and get into this and see what kind of horrors await us. I once had it all. My palate was sated, nostrils stimulated. Standing, venerated. And one day, you took everything away but shame and pain. I'm still not sure what game you're playing. It's layers of fear. But I'm back. 2023. <laughs> Right to Story, Chapter One. Oh, oh. All right. Well, what do we have here? Is this a lighter? Oh, oh. Okay. I'm pressing E. Doesn't work. F. Doesn't work. I'm guessing it it's made me here. think of your poem. Congratulations. Oh wait, no. <laughs> Something important. Wait, give it back. I was I wasn't done looking. I wanted to rotate the lighter, getting a closer look. That also looks like a note right there that I could read. Maybe maybe from this same person. Never call him by real name. Never never tell where it is. No dates. Mid twenties? Include the most important facts about the newspaper articles, about the scandal. Huh. Do I just have like a My little shed by the lighthouse here? Oh all by my lonesome, huh? Dear, congratulations once again on winning our competition. Let us repeat, your submission astonished us, and we are delighted to welcome you in our hermitage. Make yourself at home. The whole lighthouse is at your disposal. Is that all you're going to read? Oh. Okay. <laughs> uh, a boat will arrive once a week with supplies, and if you need anything, there's a phone on the premises. Wishing you a fruitful and inspirational stay, the management. Wow, that's so nice of them. Uh, I wonder... Ooh, that was an aggressive opening. Oh my god. It's a creaky house. Oh. Well, that's just not necessary, but fine, I'm... I'm here. The author of the winning essay will receive an opportunity to write the book on the subject in our lighthouse, accommodated especially for this purpose. Mm -hmm. 
the illegible agency invites all interested writers to submit their essays concerning the life and work of illegible, one of the most mysterious and tragic figures in the history of modern art. Submission will be open until illegible. All right, and well, obviously our character, uh, the writer, won this little competition. Can I go outside? Nope, it's locked. That's fine. I'll just stay in here. Oh, also locked. Huh? Whole lighthouse is at your disposal. My ass. Right? Maybe there's keys around. Dude, why does the generator keep coming back on and off in terms of sound? Stay on! I need the, the white noise to sleep. Ah, oh, shit. Hello? Hey! The generator's making weird noises. Hello? I received the word that you came to the lighthouse. You find everything to your liking. Well, that was fast. Yeah, I'm here. I'm very pleased to hear it. Now, are you writing? What? You must understand, Mrs. It is imperative that you start your work as soon as possible. I will remind you that you signed a contract. Uh -huh. now, it is very specific on the timeline. I, I would advise you abide by it. Goodbye. I'm going to take my time, buddy. You better watch out. Inspiration doesn't strike instantaneously. Yeah, that was a conversation I was too sober for. Right? June 1955. Okay. What do we have here? I'm an adult, Mama. Crippled or not, I can take care of myself now. It's time for you to focus on yourself. I can't wait to read that book. Love you. You're... Why, why, why do we th keep having things cut off? Why is everything messed up? Chapter 1, Marriage. Chapter 2, Accident with Fire. Chapter 3, Destruction of Marriage. Metaphor, shape-changing environment? Avoid? Uh, I can't read that. Avoid something fiction nonsense. Avoid, is it supposed to be science? Avoid as science. Something. Hello? Can you knock it off? <laughs> I, I'm going to continue investigating this place. We got to make sure it is fully locked up. Oh, the lighthouse. Hold on now. Before I go ascending the lighthouse, which you know, uh, probably does some crazy things if I do that. Let me go to the generator room. Make sure we're all properly set up. Lights are kind of flickering and that doesn't seem good. Well, I'm not picking that up. Look, I'm aware of the rat's presence, okay? But nothing can be done about it. They've been on this island as long as anyone can remember. It's in our best interest to leave them be. Uh, hey, it's not my fault if I lay out a trap and they run into it. It's natural selection. We're just trying to make smarter rats here, okay? Smart enough to not get caught at the very least. Hey, baby. Make sure they don't make too much noise in the walls either. Ugh. All right, I guess I'll go up the lighthouse. So I'm wondering if this writer is, uh... Writing about the first character from the first layers of fear, and we're getting like a little in-between section. Oh, I can't climb up this anyways. <laughs> you say it's out of order, but what if I just hop over the chain? Our sources say 428 entries have been submitted to the agency. The entry that won was surprising, to say the least. It wasn't a scholar who won it, nor someone with proper education that would give him an understanding of life. It was a sensationalist, a horror writer, and... Okay, well, this just seems like a mean thing to have here. <laughs> Prestigious stipend stolen by Illegible. Many great, talented Americans took part in the contest set up by the Illegible Agency. The first edition of the event promised a great prize. A solitary stay in their lighthouse to focus on writing uh, would be a dream come true for many. <laughs> I don't think... I don't think those writers are missing out, honestly. 
I think our riders get in the short end of the stick. Uh, don't have a flashlight. F zooms in. I'm guessing Q and E are going to do something at some point. I guess... I could get started writing. Hello? Hey! I'll put out a trap. Alright, you better not mess with me. <laughs> oh, we already have some traps here. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Illegible. <laughs> Whoa. What the fuck? That was loud. Hello? Mr. Rat! Did you knock something over? Oh. Well, that was... <laughs> something must be getting dragged around on the rooftop or something, right? Nothing, nothing horrific should be happening. Oh, jeez. Oh. That locked room, huh? You know, I, I know I complained. The rats, huh? I know I complained about the door being unlocked, but that doesn't mean I necessarily needed to go in here. So what do we got back here, huh? The painting? A painting? I know the first game had a bunch of stuff about paints. What? Hey, why don't you stay one type of paint, huh, buddy? I'll yank your chain. You better watch out. Might as well make some good use of the phone while I'm here. <laughs> Are we gonna call for fucking help? 911! That's the number we need. Are we even dialing anything Hello? properly there? Hi, darling. I'm calling to let you know I'm here. Can you believe the agency already called to see if I was working? That's insane. Did you at least have time to settle in a bit? How's the lighthouse? Inspiring? Spooky? Haunted? All of these things. I was just looking around and it's... certainly something. How are you? Do the meds work? Don't you worry about me, Mama. This is your time to do your work. To live your life. <sighs> well, maybe you're right. I should probably get to it then. Hi, son. Love you. Love you too, Mama. Son, my life is shared with yours, okay? It's okay for me to be worried about you and make sure that you're doing okay. Especially since the more that we keep talking, the more likely you'll be able to catch if something bad happens to me while I'm here. Uh, anything over there? Uh, that I can super see. Old Victorian house, paintings and portraits everywhere. He's rich. Real life famous paintings. Uh, before leaving to the island, must visit an art gallery for insp uh, inspiration. Are these my notes or somebody else's? I'll assume they're my notes for, you know, writing about this person's life. The I painter's know how story. you must feel. Lost. Alone. Hopeless. You probably deserve it. Huh? But even for you, there is still a way. A way to bring it all back. The one precious thing you ever truly desired. Finish it. Every portrait that is painted with feeling is a portrait of the artist, not of the sitter. Oscar Wilde, the picture of Dorian Gray. How... Artistic. What do we have here? Dog muzzle? A little baby shoes. Hopefully worn. Or maybe hopefully not. 
The rats are keeping me company back here too, huh? We would like to ask you to cease bothering our pest control specialists, as well as refrain from sending us any more of your highly inappropriate letters. All of our employees that visited your house reported absolutely no signs of a rodent infestation of any kind, and as such, decided not to act further than a prophylactic spray. Please treat this letter as a final warning, or else the next envelope you'll receive will be from our lawyers. <laughs> they didn't even read the Ruth best regards. I don't think they had best regards for me at all. There's clearly rats here. Huh. I'm not crazy. They should have sprayed the house down more. Some call him the new Carvaggio, others compare him to Van Eyck, and one awestruck critic who wished to remain unnamed went as far as to invoke, quote, the spirit of the great Leonardo. Any way you slice it, the exhibition proved an immense success. Its distinct style has been praised for its unique combination of Renaissance influences and more progressive techniques. The artist himself attended the event in the company of his beautiful fiance, looking stunning in her black gown revealed to us exclusively that the couple are indeed expecting. We've got a kid on the way! Why do, why do we keep crossing off my name and everybody else's name here? This is ridiculous. I know that I can simply be referred to as the painter or the writer or, or whatever, but... That doesn't mean you have to do it. Oh, I didn't Jesus. touch the workshop, just like you asked. Although, I can't imagine the mess that's inside. Also, if you care so much for that room, maybe you should pay more attention to where you leave the keys. I brought them back to your office. Okay. So I can't get in here right now? That's fine. I'm looking around. Ah, uh, <laughs> not that way though. <laughs> Gonna have a hard pass on that for now. Hmm. Figured you'd be up all night, so I made you a little treat. You know, I bet even Rembrandt occasionally took time off from being brilliant and snored his head off like the rest of us common folk. <laughs> I know. <gasps> In other words, get some sleep, you big dummy. I love you. Oh, awesome sauce. That's glad, 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 glad for you. So what are, which part's the snack? The potatoes? Hello? Can y'all, can the, the, the horror background maybe knock it off for a second? I'm just in the kitchen looking for a midnight snack that was said to be left here maybe. Jeez. Paprika. Paprika. Paint, rose dore, burnt umber, sienna, brushes, X25, air fresheners, X50 packs, apples, 10 kilograms, booze, 30. Oh, it went five, no, 10, no, 30. Sheesh. <laughs> It just sounds like I've got a regularly haunted fucking room behind me, <laughs> behind that wall. Uh, uh, nothing of use for me in this closet. Jesus. That door was blocking so much sound. Make sure the toilet's flushed. Wonderful. Don't want that backing up. Oh, uh, who left the sink on? Hey! I got a face! <laughs> I'm trying to click it. 
It doesn't do anything, though. What the hell did they fuck up the length? <laughs> Is that my character? How the hell did they fuck up the length? Well, I guess we'll just leave the sink on. You know, gotta wash the floor. Dog! Where's my dog? I'm sorry for yesterday. You were right. I overreacted. It's just that this isn't about me. It's about her. Everything I do, I do with her best interest in mind. I guess I've always believed that in an imperfect world, it's worth it to strive for perfection. Ah, uh, now I'm starting to sound like my father. I will work on my temper, though. Promise. We'll talk later. Is that for me to my fiance? Yeah, it does look like we made quite a mess here. Ooh, Kalak. Wow. Uh, we'll get you yet, little rats. Little Vinny and partners, got a rat problem? Call us now and forget about it. Uh, five, 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 three, eight, two, five. Fast, efficient, and discreet. Not fast enough. I'll have to do it myself. If I can make it to the end. Uh. <laughs> I think I'll go upstairs first. Ew. That's creepy. These all mine. Huh. I'm so sick and tired of us talking through these notes. We live in the same house, for God's sake. Come talk to me when you're done, before you go to sleep. Uh, understandable. Maybe. I don't know what room is yours. I also don't know which direction I should be going first. <laughs> I know that at some point... <laughs> okay. Wait, wait. Oh, no, it closed! Ah! I'm sorry for touching the piano! God! <laughs> I was just gonna be like, I'm not a perfect person. I make creepy paintings in the night. night. Don't wake me up. Hey! Is there more than. Oh. Oh. Not cleaning that up. Oh! Wedding ring. Or, well, just a ring. I'm not sure what type. This is... Kind of a cramped little bed here, considering how long this room is. Jeez. I don't know if there's, like... If I'm this dude? Sorry. Couldn't sleep. The leg's been acting up again. Figured I might as well do some work. I love you. Well, if, I, if you know, if it's my leg that's acting up, give me the cane for protection, of course. Okay, well, it doesn't seem like Control or C lets me crouch down. The long awaited opening of the Galactic Department store turned into hell on Earth when the building's wiring burst into flames. While the majority of the visitors managed to reach the emergency exits in time, several unfortunate attendees were trapped in the back of the building, having no chance to escape the raging inferno. The exact number of casualties has not yet been determined, although it is estimated that at least a dozen people have been severely injured. The owner of the Galactic, Ronald Sheffield, has so far declined the comment on today's tragic events. Hey, that guy gets a name too, Ronald Sheffield? Maybe he's more important than me. 
It's gonna leave all of our drawers unlocked now. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Sorry. It's not played with that instrument. Might not be a household name yet, but just give her time. The incredibly talented multi-instrumentalist gave an astounding performance last night, winning over even the most ardent naysayers. Quote, she was simply astounding. I haven't seen such passion, energy, and skill in years, stated famed pianist Daniel Richter. He was not alone in his praise. It seems even Anthony Giles, one of his harshest critics, has finally seen the light. Giles had previously made disparaging comments about the artist, stating, quote, there's more to performing music than enthusiasm in a pretty face. When asked if after witnessing last night's performance, he regrets these words, Mr. Giles gave us a look that can only be described as a mixture of awe and embarrassment. Pressed for an answer, he simply said, yes. We caught up with the star. Hmm. If I like squint close enough, it almost looks like maybe one of the letters could be like a C, or maybe it's like a, a Clara or something. You know, like maybe they actually put the word there and then crossed it off. I don't know though. So I guess my character is the painter and my fiance is a multi-instrumentalist. She plays piano, violin, etc. Let me ask you one simple question. Have you completely lost your goddamn mind? Uh. I know you're going through some rough times right now. I really do. That's why I've agreed to let you do those illustrations in the first place. For old time's sake. I even deliberately gave you a trivial task. Because I expected Little Red Riding Hood to be something you can draw in your sleep. What I didn't expect is to get this demented nightmare fuel you submitted for a kid's bedtime story. There is no way in hell I'm using this, and I already regret agreeing to a payment in advance. Please, get your shit together. <laughs> That's fair. I can imagine my... character is making creepy-ass drawings. Rather than giving them what they wanted. Is this it? Oh, yeah. I mean, that's pretty good. Uh, <laughs> sometimes. Oh, oh, okay, okay. <laughs> All right, now hold on. <laughs> that's a bit. That's, that's, that's gonna be where I go. <laughs> okay, there's the line. It's been, oh my god. Sheesh. See, like this one? Not that bad. Let the big bad wolf be like a scary looking little character. But, um... <laughs> for a kid's book, maybe this is a little bit too far. Now, a subversion of the children's story, you know, like that, that makes a little bit more sense. You know, you could spin that. Just might not be the time period for that kind of thing. Hey, you gonna look at me all around the place? I fucking strongly dislike that. Ah, yeah, this is a useful implement. Maybe I should be carrying that around this place. Nope, clicked on that already. Use this my little corner for myself. I'm gonna just rock back and forth having some wine. Kids' room. Maybe the basement's a better place for me to go down to, huh? Uh, is my kid even born yet? Why pink? 
What is this? Why pink? Oh gosh. <laughs> is that the ghosts that come to chase bad fathers? Because it seems like, uh... It seems like I my kid's been born and we're criticizing what she draws. Daddy's here. Is that... is that us? I'll keep it on me, I suppose. Do I have, like, an inventory I can access? Doesn't really seem like it. It's getting loud out there. Well, I guess I can go down to the basement. This house is so empty. Why? We have a fight. You know, all these wine bottles being thrown around. And is my basement where my office is? You know, by itself, a basement isn't too bad. But when you have a creepy fucking basement with company. That's a bit of a different story. Uh, I don't like the way the candle lit up a little bit more as I got over here. Do you have something to say to me? <laughs> Can I get, like, the ghost of Christmas past to, like, come in? Maybe tell me that, like, I should be a better person to my... Family? Oh, jeez. Would that get the rats to stop breaking my shit? Report card. Sheesh. Okay, so my kid is... struggling with some things here. I'm assuming that this is for my kid. They're struggling in reading, a little bit of written communication, math's not doing too hot here. Uh, they're good at art, and they got a baba in, mu in music. Hmm, I see, I see. So they like, they like, they, they, they like art, they like music, they, they, they are trying to appease us, the parents, in terms of the things that we enjoy. Uh, and then they're excused from physical education. Maybe they have, like, some kind of illness. Anyways, my school district didn't have Ds, so, like, this is really just a lot of Fs, kid. Whoo! It's okay. I will put the blame on the, the parents. Slash, mostly, probably, the dad. And I'll probably sign them up for some super elite school. Meanwhile, home life is probably pretty terrible. Is that all the... I guess there's no office here. Down here in the basement, that is. But okay, alright, I've looked around. Maybe some other door will ominously open up and let me go into it now. Hey, we having a little race? Uh, okay. <laughs> I didn't touch. Yeah, I know. I know. All right. So then, my office would be the room up here. I had the rocking chair. That makes sense. Hey! Have you seen my keys? Ah, here we go. <laughs> I 
I guess it's a good thing I, I missed that the first time around because I probably would have gone straight down to my office rather than going into the basement. Were you open before? Shh. Let's see why these aren't in style anymore. <laughs> Loud, creepy. Ah! Okay, two lightning strikes! You don't gotta tell me, God. I've laid down a little bit, but geez. No, this is private. Oh, okay, I guess that's all I need to know. Before I snoop. Alright. Looks like my uh, kid probably came in here. Or are these like... Bird. Bird, bird, bird claws, talons. That's what they look like. Rather than like little baby hands, right? Weird. Oh, locked, 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 locked. Okay, fine. Get it right this time. I'm not sure what I got wrong before. It's covered up for a reason. Huh. Is this where the horror begins? The real horror. <laughs> Artist's block! Oh no! I can't think of what to fill in the gaps. These are all still locked. It's... Huh? Lost. You deserve it. Finish it. Well, that's not nice. Hello? I wouldn't trust this placement of an easel. I'd be a little bit more like... You know, if I were an artist uh, with the painting or easel like this, I'd have a little bit crooked. So out the peripheral of my eyes, I could see if someone's uh, entering. All right. Well, I'm assuming that two souls change so something. Passionate, so talented, and yet they wanted to build something so ordinary. Well, a home, a wife, a family, peaceful life, betrayal of everything that made them both artists. And yet, they clung to it. This definitely wasn't the area I just left. Save the date. Uh, request the pleasure of your company to celebrate their wedding of on cent uh, Saturday, the 9th of June at St. Luke's Chapel at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Hmm. Another June. All those times ago. Whoops, uh, sorry. I Open that a little bit quickly. <laughs> we are truly thrilled to hear that you accepted our humble proposition. After discussing dates with my colleague, we find this date the best time to open the exhibition. We need time to set everything up. Getting a piano to our gallery will be no small feat. Respectfully, Thomas Caldwell, illegible gallery. I bet. Just out of reach. Oh, Jesus. I, I clicked. <laughs> that, that one might be on me. I clicked right as I closed, though. I'm not sure. What is this? Is that a dead rabbit and bird? Hmm. The picture of Dorian Gray, Oscar Wilde. So is the hallway just going to change over and over again? Ah, jeez. They don't understand what it takes to make a good painting. 
The work doesn't start with the brush. Just like family doesn't start with marriage. It starts with canvas. First step is the hardest. I can't remember the last time I wore these. The last time I could move freely. It's a painting of like a castle wall? Castle tower? Oh, you know what? At the bottom right it shows like the top left of an image. I guess I'm assembling a picture. Like a puzzle. I ain't turning around. Alright. Bart Murillo, Sepsum Depin Gens Profilorium, Votis Akpreci Bos Explendis. Does that translate to you? <laughs> Don't turn around or you're fucking dead. Uh. Uh huh. So who's shuffling out there? Oh, I'm fully locked in, huh? Wow. Um, still locked up. You still saying the same thing over here? Oh, key! Wanderer. Did it unlock this? Wow. Now, a tiny bit to the left. Yes, just like that. Hold that pose. I want to get all those lovely curves just right. <laughs> I'm not that round! <laughs> Never forget. I mean, I, I kind of guess I have, considering. It seems like I'm going through a, a hell of my own mind or something. You can stay on the floor, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I'm not going over there. Oh. Oh man, you know, I... <laughs> hey! Oh, I need this. Alright, fine, I guess I'll randomly check out things that fall. Oh, 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 God, the skull is, or the skeleton, it looks like a skeleton, that brief little flash. It's, it's hunting me. Both of the past and the future. Hey! You're not gonna screech at me or something, right? You think this guy's gonna screech at me, this fucking little dead deer? I think he's gonna screech at me. He's gonna do something to spook me out. Stop bleeding from the mouth! Ah, God! All right, I'm sorry. That was rude of me to request. Not really your choice, I suppose. Huh. The fuck am I? Buried hopes never die. Uh, yeah, just the person, I guess, dies I with it. I think I have the music for all the paintings now. I'm going to play it for you this evening. You're going to love it. Illegible. What the fuck's illegible on this? <laughs> There's like nothing. <laughs> huh? It's totally fine. Can I? I'm trying to like rotate it to its backside, but I can't. Wait, where'd the painting over here go? Hello? The fuck? Hey! <laughs> you're keeping me coming over here. Now you're just gonna leave like that? Ugh. Dreadful. Yeah, I'll just delicately put that over there. Oh, there you are. Thanks. What is this? Light switch? Oh! Yeah! Ugh. Hey, your face was just melting off. Uh, do you need help? It must be sharper. Sharper, sharper for what, though? And I'm not gonna turn out to be like some. crazy killer of my family, right? Like, went. Nuts with the rats and decided, yeah, just slicing up my wife and kid. That's the call. Mm. Wow, turning, turning painting ink into wine. 
I'm Jesus. Sorry I haven't written in a while. I've been swarmed with work. I gotta tell you, your last letter was troubling, to say the least. I just can't believe she would set fire to your old paintings. Why would she do that? The lady in black especially? That was your tribute to her, wasn't it? I don't know what to tell you except to get her some professional help pronto. You could probably talk to someone as well. With all that's happened, I'm sure it would do you some good. I probably don't need to tell you that the buyer was sorely disappointed with the news. The new pieces just aren't selling as well as the classics. Anyway, I'll keep looking. You just hang in there and focus on your work. I know you still have it in you. I believe in you. Oh, and then he <laughs> we wrote, I don't on there. Uh, what the fuck is this lever for? Oh, my, my ominous secret entrance in the basement or something? Jeez. Uh, uh. You can't fight her. She will break you. Uh. What do you mean by that? Maybe this was a two-way street kind of dealio, right? You know, I, I, I said before that it would be like maybe a, 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 okay. That maybe our kid was having a rough time because of the parents, and that it was maybe mostly on the dad, because that happens a lot in stories. But maybe, <laughs> maybe the, our wife, yeah. Maybe my wife had some deep issues of her own that didn't translate too well to being a family at this time. All right. Not the fox. Gross. Whoa! <laughs> the books were trying to attack Don't me. Don't be scared. It's just a book, Birdie. Is that, is that my nickname for my kid, Birdie? Where's the other? Or is that all? Is this just a three number lock? Uh, six, nine, four. Six. Nine. Four. What's inside? Oh, just a key? Alright. I heard something walking around behind me, but... I can't do anything about that. So, you know, I can't crouch, I can't... This is fine. Really run? This is good. Th these are great conditions. I can finish it. I can. Are you still looking? I will. I need to. For all our sakes. For our family. For our family? Or just for you? Go on. Tip the scales. I, I, it can, oh, jeez, it can be a little bit of both, right? Finish the painting, help out our family and me, it's kind of the same thing. Man, I don't even know <laughs> what the hell I'm walking by and hasn't been there before sometimes. Like, I was looking left, and then, and then this is here, was this here when I walked in? This seems like it just got lit up a little bit more while I was looking away. Which color should I choose? Well, I mean, oh. Ah. Green of her eyes. The red of my paint. Well, I like green, so <laughs> that's a no-brainer. Hey! Whole hallway changed up. You have anything for me here? No? Okay, I'm just trying to assemble the other pictures. Is that our wedding photo? God, we gotta stop crossing stuff off. Scraps of love. Yeah, hardly. Shapeless dreams. I don't know, they seem to have quite a bit of shape. <laughs> 